You know what, Mr. Roberts? The only reason? Cause I need a full length mirror. I can't even see my face. I get to the theater and I know that the managers are supposed to be here any minute. I am so freaked out that this editor is not gonna deliver the reel in time for my showcase. Oh my goodness, I'm so pissed off right now. Catching that bus ugh, looks like, catching that bus is like. If you guys wanna take the seat, that would be great. Catching that bus is like. It's showtime, princess. For real? The editor has not brought in the reel yet. And now I'm just gonna be real with. Anybody home? I'm sitting there, two minutes to showtime, and who shows up at my dressing room? That fat, nasty, greasy bastard. Got your reel. Thank you. Hope you like it. I, okay, I hope so too. Break a leg. How about I break your leg? I'm so pissed off with the editor, but I'm not gonna let him ruin my chances and throw me off my game. Is this really it? This is really it, girl. <gasps> Ow. If I forget something, what the f If you forget something, take a minute and just pick up where you remember. I feel like I could step out there and go blank and not remember anything that I was supposed to do at all. I now present Tiffany, AKA New York Pollard. It was January of 2006 when America first met a young girl from Utica named Tiffany. Slap me, bitch! Little did anyone know that she would become reality television's brightest rising star. But the world of reality TV was too small to hold a star like New York. And soon enough, Tiffany Pollard was everywhere. If you want this show to go, you are going to have to create conflict. All you need to do is sit there and worry about getting your hair burnt What down. you need to do is stand up there and burn a job out. That's what you need to do. What does the future hold for Tiffany Pollard? Only you can say. Tiffany Pollard, America's Princess. I beg your pardon, sir? Oh, I wish I could help, but I got a 6.30 bus to catch. And if I miss it, I won't be home till midnight. And I gotta be home way earlier than that because I got a second job I gotta be ready for in the morning. And plus, that's a real big dog. I saw what he did out there on the lawn earlier today. <laughs> that dog dropped some bricks. Ooh. <laughs> Say what? I'm fired. Now I see that you don't give a damn about me. All you wanted me to do was pick up dog at 6.30 in the afternoon when I'm supposed to be catching my bus back home. But you know what? Compared to cleaning up after that big ass beast of yours out there in the lawn, catching that bus, <laughs> looks like catching a stretch limit on me right about now. <laughs> hmm. be the best actress yet, I think I nailed it. I'm looking really good, and these managers better recognize. You did so good! Are you gonna bail? Right in. Okay. Remember, they don't know the script. You played it off well. Is Tiffany coming out? Does anyone know? I love to say hello before I take off. I gotta make a love to the script. I just barely French kissed that <laughs> I better pop a breath in it, because I know I smell like liquor. Are we leaving? Where is she? Yeah. Where's everybody at? I can't believe these SOBs skipped out on me. It looks like the showcase was a flop. I think they need to get ready for another production. I need a manager to help me guide my career, but who's going to guide me to find a manager? Becoming an actress, it's a lot more work than I thought. 